This isn't your average everyday red face. This is sunburn red face, I guess. This ear. Look at this ear. I did not put sunscreen on this ear. Look at this ear in comparison. Okay? Well, actually, now that I look at it, they look pretty similar. But this one is a lot better than this one. Like this one, this, like, oh yeah, right there. Right where I was touching there. Right at the very tip top. Yeah, that hurts to touch. And I guess that side is burnt too, but uh, my hand got it actually. Like, that, you can, you can tell that's a sunburn right there. Like, that's kind of burnt. More tan than burnt, but that's because I put sunscreen there. I didn't put sunscreen there, or here, obviously. Anyway, that's a whole minute of this video wasted. Well then, perfect. Off to a smashing start as always. Um, so the race happened. I was, there, there was a demolition derby here the second this race started. It was a good demolition derby, so I think the trade-off was okay. There was two rollovers. I, I slapped myself for not bringing my camera along. But there were two rollovers. That was pretty awesome. Um, but I, I watched that, and then I came back, and it was about 55 laps in, and I'm, I turn it on, and the first thing I see, Jimmy Johnson is ahead by 22 seconds, and I'm like, fuck me. And then I sit there for a little while longer, and I see Martin Truex Jr. is in 42nd. And I'm just, I just, I, at that point, I'm just like, fine. I just sat back like this for most of the race. Uh, yeah. I was just like, fine, I accept it. This is what I get for not watching the race. I need to be diligent. I actually had an opportunity to watch this race. If it had been on last week, I would have worked the entire time and I wouldn't have seen a second of it. I had an opportunity to watch this race and I squandered it, so it, it gave me it gave me something to think about, I guess. There is a zit right there. Okay, so there is a mole right here and a zit right here, and I didn't know there was a zit right here until just then. So all day I'm feeling this and I'm like, my mole is getting massive. And I was like, skin cancer! God damn it, I really should have used that sunscreen, but yeah. It's okay. It's all good. For now. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm kind of pent up full of energy right now. I haven't recorded anything in like a week, so I haven't been able to, you know, get into the groove of things. All I've recorded was the top 10 gay characters and games, and that was just, um, that was just a casual, casual, casual Tuesday, I guess. And I just dropped something on the floor and I can't find it. Well, I'll have to look for that later because I have a video to do. So I didn't see the first couple of laps, obviously. I got in about halfway. Right when Almendinger went to the garage was the commercial break that came back when I got back. Because I got here, turned it on, saw Martin Truex was in 42nd. It went to commercials. And then when it came back, Almendinger was going to the garage. Hey, there it is. Found it. Um, beyond that, it was a pretty tame race, honestly. Um, pretty tame. There were a few wrecks, of course. Um, Edwards and Reagan really stick out as a, as a wreck. I'm sure they're going to add that one to the video page package for the commercials for Infineon next year. Mark my words, that one's going to be in the commercial. But, um, let me just get into a more relaxed position here. I'm just going to rattle through what I remember happening. Um, I don't remember much. It must not have been that good. All I know is that Johnson dominated it as always. Boyer looked like he was going to win. I'm sitting there like, my God, is Boyer going to win this race? But then Kyle Busch got past him on that last restart, and I... I thought Boyer still had a chance, but it did not. Curtis was coming in with a big charge there at the end. And I would have liked Curtis to win more. Because I actually like Curtis as compared to Kyle Busch, but, uh... You know... It's not terrible, 
that Kyle Busch won. Obviously, it could have been worse. There were several other drivers. Oh, Tony Stewart was up there in the top 10 for so long. And when he went into the pit stop and came out in like the 20s, I just felt so bad. I was just, I just kept tweeting out. I feel so sorry for Smoke, but um, it's a good thing that he did go into the pits though because I f have the feeling that if he stayed out, he would have dropped even more positions, but I just felt so bad for Tony Stewart in that instance. He was going to get a top five finish, and then he didn't, and so I'm still waiting for a good finish here. What else happened? McDowell had an awesome weekend. He was in... Got top 10 in both practice sessions. Michael McDowell got top 10 of the best speeds in practices both times. And... He didn't out, he didn't out he didn't really perform that well in the race. Of course he qualified twenty third, you know. He qualified a lower position than both of his other practices combined and probably finished in the thirties. I didn't check beforehand, I should have, but yeah. So I'm just waiting for Daytona. I got a couple of commercials. I thought I had the winner's arsenal right here. But I didn't see half the race, so I really didn't try on commercials. But I did catch a few of them. Got two points for Ford, one for Sprint, and one for Nationwide. My other ones were KFC and Castrol. I didn't see any of KFC, and I wasn't really paying that much attention. So I guess ah, that's my excuse for that one. I was going to have a video last week for how to uh, play fantasy commercials, like legitimately. But I never uploaded it. Maybe I'll do that at some point this week. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm probably going to have a separate announcement video for this, too. But uh, tomorrow is a live Q&A. The end of June Q&A. June 30th, 2015. So if you're watching this in 2025, I apologize. It kinda, you're kind of late to the party. But, um, yeah. Um, live Q&A. <laughs> so, yeah. We're done here. Um... Out of, I give it a, I give it a Jersey Barrier out of five. Um, needs more Almendinger, needs more Ambrose. Uh, yeah, that's, that's all I got. Hopefully Daytona goes well.